2013 Mercedes E220 here. It's the 220 diesel, this one, coupe with the automatic gearbox. I'm just going to take the key off there, sorry about that. Right, body weight wise, I'm going to start with the bonnet, went our way around the interior, and then we're going to fire it into the next. So it's a 220 Sport diesel, this one. Automatic gearbox, install of the black interior. Got the bonnet itself all nice and straight, no big dings or dents there, all nice and tidy. Across the front there, the grill's all good, headlights are nice and clear all the way across. But the corner's scuff free on the left hand side. There's a few stone chips across the front end, but that's all you can expect really. And on the right hand side again, scuff free on the corner itself, lights nice and clear. Flat wheels all the way around on this one. No corrosion coming through on that front wing or wheel arch there on the right hand side. Making our way up the right hand side there, you'll see the indicator and wing where a cap is crack free there. All the very, very small, oh, bit of polish on the mirror there, no scuffs or scrapes. And across the roof, nice and tidy with one or two little bird poo marks and the on light surface scratch where it's been washed over the years. As we come down the driver's door, nice and tidy down there. Lower half thought okay. Again, one or two little surface scratches here and there, but no corrosion, no nasty things or dents. Around the rear arch, again, nice and tidy, no rust coming through at all around the rear arch. There's a little bit of a stone chip like appeal above the chrome trim, but that's all. And you'll see we have got a drip, I think it must be super glue or something. Was it a drip of glue there with a couple of splatters on top of the paint, slightly heavy scratch there. Around the fuel for the caps, all okay though. Rear lights are nice and clear, high level brake lights all good across the whole back end there. You see we've got the MG badge stuck on there as well. But the corner left hand side, we've had a scrape here on the corner it's broke through the paint there and another one here where we have got some creasing across the back bumper there where things have been put in the boot over the years you will see that with another indent there on the back bumper on the right hand side with a scuff above it again a few more marks across the back bumper itself down the left hand side on the rear quarter no rust coming through the quarter itself paint seems to be a little bit flat on that rear quarter on the rear left hand side doors all okay with a few little stone chips a little parking den just below the handle there and one further back on the left hand side door again wing rear cap is crack free on both sides indicators all nice and clear front wings all nice and shiny nice and tidy around the arch there a few little stone chips down the lower half black leather interior on this one door card itself lovely and tidy on the door card seat itself a little nick there on the seat and a little bit on the uh, a little bit of a, a crease there with some leather flating off on the bolts on the right hand side it has got the air bolsters as well this one but apart from that rest of the seats are lovely and tidy in there nice black amg mat steam wheels good dashboard's all nice and standard down the center console there all nice and straight and again we have got the air bolsters which is a good extra we are seats in lovely condition there. It's nice being a proper four seat coupe, this one. Really nice and tidy. Seats are a lovely shape as well. Electric boot off the uh, key popped up there. Nice and tidy in the boot carpet. Spare wheels there. Space saver with the jack as well. Left hand side front door there. Again, nice and tidy on the door. Little, little tear in the seat there on the uh, insert swab air bolsters again dashboards nice pop the seat forward and again nice and tidy in the rear seats from the left hand side there so we'll pop the bonnet while we're there must be on the driver's side there james door car nice and tidy as well james is going to pop the bonnet for us there we go releases here somewhere there you go so it's a 220 diesel this one james is going to start it up for us in the life auto lights on as well any lights on the dash there james the what sorry engine management light is on there it was driven us today about 40 mile and I wasn't told of any issues there, so engine, engine management light is on as well, please bear that in mind. And there you have it, the 2013 on a 13 Mercedes E220 Coupe in silver with a black interior.